Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to convert decimals to percents. We'll start by going through some example problems together, and then I'll give you some practice problems that you can try on your own. Let's jump into our examples, starting with number one, where we have 0 0.52, 52 hundredths. Now, when going from a decimal to a percent, all we need to do is multiply by 100. Multiply the decimal by 100, and that will give us the percent. And remember, a quick way to multiply by 100 is to move the decimal twice to the right. So for number one, let's multiply by 100 by moving the decimal once, twice to the right. This gives us 52%. Now we don't need that decimal at the end, after the two, when we write our percent, since this is a whole number here. We can leave that off. So for number one, our decimal 52 hundredths equals 52%. Let's move on to number two, where we have 0 0.01, so one hundredth. Let's multiply by 100 by moving the decimal once, twice to the right. So it comes after the one now, which gives us one percent. One hundredth equals one percent. Let's move on to number three, where we have 0 0.9, 9 tenths. And I'm going to rewrite this decimal underneath because we're going to need a little more room for this one. So let's multiply by 100 by moving the decimal once, twice to the right. So we have a gap there. Now we need to fill that gap, that place, with a zero. So our percent here is 90 percent. Nine tenths equals 90 percent. Lastly, let's move on to number four, where we have 0 0.436, 436 thousandths. Let's multiply by 100. Once, twice to the right. So the decimal goes in between the three and the six. So we have 43.6 percent. 436 thousandths equals 43.6 percent. So those were our example problems. Let's move on to some practice problems that you can try on your own. So have paper and a pencil ready. So here are your practice problems. I'll give you four minutes and then we will go over the answers. Feel free to pause if you need more time or jump ahead to the answers whenever you are ready. Go ahead and start.
Okay, so that was four minutes. Let's go over the answers. So here are our answers. For number one, we have 97%. For number two, 4%. For number three, 61.3%. And lastly, for number four, 80%. So there you have it. There's how to convert decimals to percents. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.